Good evening, fellow wanderers. Just Jeremiah here. I'm in Brawley. Brawley's like, well, actually, I know because I rode my bike here. It's 25 miles from Slap City. And when I missed the bus by like seven minutes in Nyland, I could have waited like two hours and 40 minutes for the bus or rode my bike two hours. And if you've known me very long, you know I'm not the type to just sit still. So I just rode my bike. I mean, it's flat and it's a desert, but it's a desert. And my butt totally hurt by the end. Oh. Got to fly a sign, did great. People weren't super, they didn't have as much weed to offer as they did in Palm Springs, but they were really nice and supportive. And you know, I only got one negative person. You get a lot of negative people when you're panhandling. So I'm waiting on the bus. It's prom tonight in Slap City. All I have is that vest. I don't even have an outfit. I should have gone to like a thrift shop or something, but I'm totally going to go. It's at the Red Room Room. I haven't been there yet, and I'd like to show it off. Hopefully people are going to be willing to talk about prom and talk in general. Uh, I didn't go to prom. Did you go to prom? I bet you did. I was so shy, and I know I said this before. I was shy, and I just, yeah, you're not going to catch me dancing. And like, I just never felt like I fit in anywhere, ever. Which is why I roll solo. Uh, yeah, check this out. Human bowling in the skate park? Yes. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Human bowling? I mean, I'll drop 20 bucks to have some fun. If I'm going to be making this money by panhandling, I'm going to spread it around some uh, in the slabs. I mean, I hate to say it, but they all have the same opportunity to go and fly a sign and sometimes I feel like and not all of them but sometimes I feel like people judge me and act like I'm one of those trust fund babies as they call them or yuppies but I've been living off of no money for months now not a single dollar I haven't accepted money from a friend yet or anyone except strangers uh, although that's a thing that would make most people feel low and I did feel low especially at first like over in Buddhist Buddhist uh, countries like that's what you do. You go on a you go on a walk for a long time and you only eat the food that people offer you and you know, you're basically begging. It's considered like an altruistic thing. It's letting go. Letting go of attachments. I have so many attachments and I'm trying to work on my mental health. And I know it sounds nuts that I'm gonna have to go panhandle and beg on the streets to work on my mental health, but I swear I am and it's working. I feel pretty awesome. Like I feel together. I feel this crisp air in my skin and I'm not thinking about anything negative I'm just thinking about right now and right now is pretty awesome I appreciate you letting me share it with you and I look forward to tonight I can't wait to see what prom's like I'm gonna feel just as awkward as I did when I was a kid but whatever I've got that fancy vest to show off and who knows maybe there's other people going stag <laughs> would you go to prom with me I didn't ask you right now uh, because I want you to show up. I'm just curious. Just kidding. Uh, I'm going to ramble and say stupid stuff and probably stutter. And I like this video, so I'm going to stop now before I have to, like, cut it awkwardly or just, like, not use it. So have a great e evening. Wake up tomorrow. Make plans. Get outside. And write in the comments about it. Tell me how awesome outside is. Take care. Bye.